it seems, in my observation, that much of new media that's produced nowadays, meaning games, videos, and content, appears to have climate change in mind, or at least as an allegory. Take, for instance, Sony's brand new IP exclusive, well, it's not brand new, but it's the second part to a series called Horizon. I'm going to put a clip here of just the first few minutes and tell me if this doesn't sound exactly like climate change. I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, I'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then, extinction. Right. Yes, it should pretty much hit that on the nail on the head. And then you have that Chris Pratt movie where they go back in time and save people from, an, from aliens attacking. Sounds kind of familiar. I think we'll be feeling that way in 2030. And of course, Don't Look Up, and not to mention Battlefield 2042, which is based in the future when the whole world has gone to shit from climactic weather events, world wars, all kinds of stuff. So, yeah, the subliminal messaging is, is there. Most children are familiar with some preceding event. They, they're familiar with something that's going to happen in the future that's not going to be pleasant. And I've made over 300 videos on this channel, some of it very personal, and much of it pertaining to the climate collapse. And much like many of you observers, I was going through the feelings of, of, of losing everything and the insanity of living day to day. And even on the most conservative measures, we have to reduce everything by 50%, which is, which is non, a non-starter. Okay. So I wanted. I went to bed wanting to record this video. I just woke up and drinking my tea, having finished it. What I wanted to say was, I am going to be skipping with joy into the collapse when suddenly there are hundreds of millions of people dying from heat waves, heat stress, and cold. But let's talk about heat right now on the equator, and we're seeing that on the news. And then suddenly, uh, cough syrup doesn't come in into your local store because the factory that produced that is experiencing a level five hurricane, and it wiped out the facility. I mean, we're gonna have fourteen trillion dollar weather disasters like every year, minimum. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be so awful. Like, one shipment that doesn't show up to the grocery store, you're gonna see a whole wall go empty. Take three shipments, four, five, by the end of the week, nothing is in the store. Everyone's running around like chickens with their heads cut off. And I'm gonna be like, skipping like, ah, this is happening, this is fucking happening. You remember, I mean, how many people I yelled at and told about this in 2022, 2021, early 2020s? You know, like, sports people, yeah, there's a, there's a basketball game today, there's a football game. But everything's fucking gone, they can't play, there's no food. Like, we're literally, like, it's, it's, it's a surreal. I'm just going to be, I'm really going to be skipping with joy. I'm going to be laughing in 95% of people's faces, and I'm going to take great joy in that. Believe me, I've had my tears. I've had my crying. Like, I've, I've gone through the, you know, the acceptance. Like, trust me, now it's, it's, it's going to be fun. It's going to be really fun when, because there's no other way to make it, when everything starts collapsing. You know, people are starting to band together, the smart ones, and grow their own food where they can, and small, you know, permaculture growing, you know, farms, 
that's cool, but a majority of the public is gonna be completely blindsided. And we're gonna start seeing these effects by the end of this decade. You know, things are gonna start going empty, gas prices will go up, like we're, we're reaching peak everything. Oh my God, it's gonna be so, I'm gonna be, I can't just express the joy and, and the hysteria I'm gonna feel while other people are like, oh my God, there's nothing. I'm gonna be like, ah, exactly. This is what we get. This is where we're at. You're welcome. It was there all along. We knew it. The science. So oh, now you believe in science. Fucking dumbasses everywhere. So I'm going to be skipping into the apocalypse now. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys later. Peace.